You have, or you already have this, Jane. Yes. These are the images that are in the children of children, right? Oh, fantastic. Okay. And I'm going to show you the work of a master. And you as an artist, well, you, you don't need this anymore. You got this covered. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me show you the work of a master. Right now. As an artist, Jay, you can appreciate this, mm. but you're going to appreciate it more when I turn it over. This is felt chip pen, as full as and as full of ink as possibly, right? Mm -hmm. Put down on the most porous paper. You can touch the paper, right? See how porous it is? Yep. It will give up any indecision, any correction, any, any, anything that you, you do there, you can't hesitate. You gotta go to the next stroke, you gotta put it down, right? This is the work of a master. Not only do you get composition, you get movement, you get all of that in this work, is that, yes. I, did I overstate yes. it? Virgin yes. territory, your eyes light up, my it's friend. It's incredible, it's huh? incredible. Nobody's ever talked about it. I want you to talk about it. Mm. Mm -hmm. You can spend lots of time talking about it. You see that? Mm -hmm. And you see how it comes out here? This, if you were, if you were uh, listening to uh, Oscar Peterson or, mm -hmm. or Dave Brubeck or any of those, you would hear the articulation if you were listening to mm -hmm. uh, Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Charlie Yardbird Parker mm -hmm. playing, you would hear the articulation. Do you get the articulation mm -hmm. here? Absolutely. Now what you also get, if you're listening, and what Breeden would talk about and being an artist, it is not what you lay down. It is what you do with space. It's the same in music. It's what you mm -hmm. do with mm -hmm. space. You know what I mean yep. by space? Yep. Yep. It's, you don't have to put everything how you handle space. Mm. So even though they look like they're on each other, but look how to look at that. Mm. Mm? Mm. You got yeah. that? Incredible. Did I, did I say too much? No. Mm? no. You said what needed to be said. Mm. said. Now, you know this is in the book. Yes. This starts off the book. You, did you want to come, you need to do a comparison? No. No? You know that this is the first image in the book. Yep. Now, what you're going to do, what you, I'm going to give you some, 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 some stuff to talk about. Oh. There, nobody's ever talked about Bearden's sensibility about discrimination, history of the Afro-American experience. His, it's always been outside of that, but it's captured in this portfolio. Hmm? Mm -hmm. right? You never get that. And I think that what you'd want to do, even in this, the skeletal, we look at art and we look at that which is, which is on the surface, but many times it is the skeleton, the skeletal. You get this, but when you turn this around, this is almost like ethereal, is mm -hmm. that the word? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The quality. But there is nothing lost in it. As a matter of fact, mm -hmm. some of the expressions are... Am I? Hmm? Mm -hmm. Are these people serious about getting this person right here? I think so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it comes out more so here than here for me. Mm -hmm. Hmm? Now this so now that you could get controversy, this this person has to think I'm being captured by ghosts. Shit, human beings don't do that to another human being. Mm? Mm -hmm. Only oh, mm -hmm. okay, that's now that's me BS and so you take it out. Mm -hmm. Go to the next. And if we turn them over, do you want the both sides, or are you all right? What do you want? No, I think that's great. I, you want both sides? I'd like both sides of this. Yeah, thank you. 
So you know how to be greedy? <laughs> the word is avarice. You can see both sides now. Mm -hmm. uh. Now what you have is you got you got just really you've got stuff to talk about. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Did all of these, did these, did uh, Bearden know about your book? No, Bearden, no, let me, do, do you want the story? Yes. The story. In 88, uh, Bearden was dying. In 87, thereabout, he gave me this body, of this portfolio, right? With the admonition, not warning, uh, with, with the notion, or uh, with the statement that said, don't fall down, Jay. Yep. That said. Do something with this. What do you do with when you get a portfolio like this? What do you do with this? Now this wasn't in a portfolio, this was just some images, right? Mm -hmm. He handed it to me. And I said, what do you mean? He said, you'll find out, you know what to do with it. So this is what you get, you get the book, right? Mm. You get the images in the book. On Holidays and Saturdays and Sundays, um, m many times we would go to museums. And we would go from, not only to museums, we would go to, from gallery to gallery. And I'm going to use my daughter uh, in terms of seeing. The body is made up of C's. You see her C? You see a C in her? Take your glasses off for a minute. And if you look at him, you see the half C's in the eyebrows, mm. you see the C's mm -hmm. here, you see the half C's in the nose, you see the half C's here, mm -hmm. you see it here, you see her chin, you see her breasts, you see, these are half C's in you, right? So if you go through the body and you go through animals, you see a dog. A dog is a half C in the back, right? And a half C on the head. Hmm? Mm. You look, and if you elongate the tail, if he's got a tail, it becomes an elongated U or whatever, right? So look at the look at the half seats. Look at this. Mm. Phyllis Wheatley mm. happened to be the, the 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 first published black. If you remember the story about Phyllis Wheatley, she's the first published black, and it was enslaved and got a poetry book published, and then the President George Washington sent her a note uh, that I, it's, in the, it's in the book that mm. talks about it. Okay, this is Phyllis Weekly, right? This is Harriet Tubman. You got the names, and you got the book. So you got the chance to do the mm -hmm. book, the art, right? Yep, absolutely. Yeah. The, the art is, good. a lot of what you see here is for sale. Mm -hmm. And you and you create environments at times. Sojourner too. Yes, sojourner too. You create environments at times. Do you do you ever go borrow art and stuff? Oh yeah. Well, shit! What you been waiting for? You don't <laughs> like black people, man? You're just just, 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 discovering, I'm just huh? discovering. Just discovering. Just huh? discovering. Just okay. discovering. John Brown, my hero. Oh. He is really my hero. Now I want you to talk about this piece. This is Rosa Parks in jail. Did no other artist have, is, at this time has presented Rosa Parks in jail. Mm. It's a historical piece. By one of, when you get finished, you're going to find out he's one of the treasures of the country. 